In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can get SMS notifications each time you get a phone lead on your website. Hi, my name is Hanna from Thrive Teams, and sometimes you want to be notified immediately when you get a new lead. This is especially true when you collect phone numbers, because when somebody leaves their phone number on your website, they want to be called back as soon as possible. You have this window of opportunity to get back to those people, and if you have to check your website or check your email or something else to know if somebody subscribed, if somebody left their phone number, well, that window might just be closed. So now I'm going to show you how you can get an SMS notification so that you know immediately when somebody left their phone number on your website. And this is done to the notification manager of Thrive Teams and with some free apps. So you will need MailChimp, you will need Twilio and you will need Zapier. But all of these three can be used for free. So let me show you how you can set this up. Now, one warning, this is not the total beginner's tutorial because you will have to copy some uh, API keys and set up some integrations, but this is also not for a developer. I'm not a developer myself and I was able to figure it out. But if you are just starting out, then this might be a little bit over your head. On the other hand, if you are a DIY website builder and you want to set up these SMS notifications, then Keep on watching and I'll guide you through it step by step. The first thing we're going to do is set up a Thrive Leads form with a telephone number. So for this, simply create a new lead group. Let's call it phone lead. You can choose any opt-in form, but for this purpose, we're going to choose a light box. Let's add one, create a form. So as you know, this is to be able to A-B test your form. So let's just give it a name. And we'll choose a simple template. Again, you can choose any template you want. This is just for testing purpose. We're going to change the text to, to make this relevant to our purpose. So fill out the form below to get your free consultation call. And I'm also going to set up a second state. So here in the add button, I'm going to add a new state. And this is going to be our thank you state. So now I, this just copied the default state. I can delete this and this. And here I'm going to say thank you. We'll be in touch. Now with this thank you state, we will be able to collect the name, the phone and the email address. And then instead of having people confirm or going to a thank you page or whatever, they will just see this thank you message and they'll know that their submission has been accepted. So let's go back to the default state. I'm just going to change this button also. Let's say it call me back. And now we're going to connect this form with MailChimp so that we can actually add the phone number. So connect with the service, create a new connection, API. Now I'm not going to show you how to set up the API connection between MailChimp and Thrive Leads, but I'll link to a tutorial underneath this video. Make sure to choose single opt-in so that people don't have to confirm their email address because this is not the goal of the form. So save. And now here, what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that we ask for the name. So we're going to display the name field and ask for the full name so that we can actually address the people on the phone with their name and make this a required field. And then we have the email, which will make an optional field, so not required. And then we'll ask for a phone number and we'll put this phone number in front of the email so that it's clear that this is the most important field and this is a required field also. And now, like I said, we'll make sure that after they sign up, so after they leave their uh, telephone number, we're going to show the thank you state. So after the form is submitted, we're going to switch state and state one to so save. Now this is set up. 
the only thing we'll have to do is to choose where we want this form to set up. So I'll go back to the settings. Here you can see that you still have the red exclamation point. And let's show this on the Hello World blog post. Of course, for your website, you're going to choose where you want to show this form, but this is just for testing. So save this and we're going to make sure that it displays on desktop. Now the form is set up, the next step is setting up the notification manager. So go to your Thrive dashboard. Let's choose the notification manager. And from here, you'll be able to add new notifications. So click on add new. So we're now going to choose the email sign up. Select the lead group phone leads and save and continue. Now, as you can see, you have three different options for the notification. So you can ask to receive an email, you can call a custom script, or you can have a WordPress notification. What we need here is to call a custom script because what we want to do is to call Zapier. Zapier is actually just a platform that will connect different apps. So Thrive Leads is gonna call Zapier, Zapier is gonna call Twilio, and Twilio is gonna send us an SMS. That's what's gonna happen here in this uh, setup. So we want to choose to call a custom script. Don't worry, nothing complicated. Just click on it and you'll see that um, the notification manager asks you for a URL of the custom script. To get that URL, you have to go to your Zapier dashboard. Like I said, this is for free. You can just sign up. You can see here I'm on a free plan, so no problem. You make, you click on the make a zap button. And from here, what we want is a webhook. So we want to make sure that Thrive Leads through a webhook can actually integrate with Zapier. So here in the built-in apps, you will find one that's called webhooks. Choose the catch hook and save and continue. No need to fill out this thing, continue. And now you'll get a URL. So let's copy this URL and paste it in our notification manager. Save this notification. Okay, so that's it. Now Thrive Leads is connected to Zapier. We're just gonna uh, check if everything is working. So to do that, we're gonna test our opt-in form. Now here's the form we've just created. Let's fill it out. And as you can see, we get the thank you state. So everything is working on the website. Now let's go back to Zapier and see if it works. Now the test was successful. So this means that Thrive Leads is successfully connected with Zapier. The next step, so this was the trigger. So the next step is the action that we want Zapier to take. And to get an SMS notification, what we want to do is to have Zapier call Twilio, because Twilio is an app that can send you SMS messages. Again, you just sign up for a free account and when you arrive in Twilio, you will be able to get a phone number. That's the first step, the first thing you'll have to do. So here, go to phone numbers, get started, and then get your first Twilio phone number. You can search for a different number if you want to. So now let's say I want to look for an American number and make sure that the SMS is activated. So you want to make sure that this number actually can send SMS messages because for example, this can give you a fixed phone number. So then SMS notifications won't be capable of being used. So for our purpose, this is not what we want. Make sure to have the SMS thing um, activated. Click search. And now, as you can see, you have a whole bunch of numbers that you can choose from. So basically just choose the one you like. Let's choose the first one. And this is your new phone number. So you will need this later on. Let's click done. So next step, we're going to connect Zapier through Twilio. So go to Zapier, continue. And here we're going to search for Twilio. Now we want to send an SMS and we're going to connect a new account. Uh, to connect Zapier with Twilio, it's asking for an account SID and for an authorization token. 
So you can simply go to your dashboard, your Twilio dashboard, and you will see both informations here. So I'm just going to copy paste. So now the Twilio account is connected, so I can save and continue. And now here it's pretty simple. The from number is the one you can uh, select. So that's the one you just bought. This you can just leave free. Your to number will be your phone number. So here, this is important that you add uh, the real phone number on which you want to receive the SMS notifications. For the message, it will be important to get the information that Thrive Leads is actually sending to Zapier. So here you can insert fields and you can see that, for example, the to get the information that we want, so in my SMS message, I want to know the uh, name that the person filled out in the form. So this is user custom data name. And I will also want to know the phone number, of course, so that I can call them back. So now I can say something like um, new phone lead. And then I will get the name. So in this case, Hanne Vervaak, uh, call, at, and this will give me the phone number. I don't need media URL, don't need to split the messages, and I click simply continue. And now this will suggest me like, okay, you will get a message, it's called new phone lead, Hanne Vervaak, call, at, and the number that I just gave in the form. So just create and continue. Now, each time that somebody leaves an phone number in one of your Thrive Leads forms, you will get an SMS notification immediately to tell them that you signed up. And one last thing, so with the free Twilio account, you will be able to get already a bunch of messages, but if you want to upgrade or if you need more messages, then you will see that you can add like $20 to this account. And if you want to see the prices, it's like ridiculously cheap. It's not even one cent per SMS that Twilio uh, charges you. So for your $20, you will get a bunch of SMS messages for sure. So now each time that Thrive Leads gets a new telephone lead, you will get an SMS so that you can call them back immediately. That's how simple it was to connect Thrive Leads with Zapier and Zapier with Twilio to get your SMS. And take a look at Zapier because there are a lot of different apps that you can use as an action. Once you've understood how to hook up Thrive Leads with Zapier, you'll see that it's just a child's game to set up other applications. Now, if you have any comments or questions, please leave them below this video.